What's up everyone and welcome to Ola's Just a Tip. It's Friday and I'm here in my beautiful house. Smelling the flowers. Ah. Plastic. I really like this chair right here. And I feel very... Very old, I guess, by sitting in this chair doing this. First tip of the week. First thing I like to talk about is the Vinipol memorial marker has been placed next to Dimebag's marker. When I saw that being posted on the Pantera and Dimebag Facebook, I felt... <sighs> I don't know how to explain it, but I kind of felt relieved, you know, to see that they were kind of like together in a way. Yeah, became really emotional seeing those pictures. And I've decided now that I will do everything in my power to go visit these markers. I hope that I can do it this year. I have to go. I just feel that I have to go to this site and pay my respects. It's the least I can do for, you know, just thanking these guys for everything they've done for me and, and everyone else that are fans of Pantera or Dimebag or Vinny. I have to plan ahead, but I'm definitely gonna go there. It kind of has become my life's mission right now. So yeah, I'm very happy to see this finally being unveiled and uh, that the guys are basically resting together. That makes me really calm and easy and nice. Great. So on a less serious note, I was browsing through Toman, the website where I purchased most of my music related gear thingies. I saw that Framus has just released the Framus Dragon again. I don't know if I recall it right, but just a year ago, I think that Framus announced that they would stop producing amplifiers, which I thought was very sad because they had the Framus Cobra, which is a sick ass amplifier. If you haven't tried it, oh, you know what to do? You go look up my video. I have one of my first videos. It's of a Framus Cobra. I think it sounded absolutely kick-ass through my microphone. Sometimes I have a lucky break and my app demos actually sound pretty good. And the Framus Cobra is one of those instances where it just, you know, everything just smacked like that. So go check out that demo if you haven't. I think it's from like 2009 or 2010 or something like that. I think it's actually one of the first amplifiers I borrowed and then i would borrow a shit ton of amplifiers to later you know test out all the amplifiers on my channel so i saw that the famous dragon is back on the website it's new i hope they're doing the cobra as well that will be sick okay famous okay and what have i been listening to this past week i've been listening to the Rheinstein. i said that last week but i don't know why <laughs> yeah i know why it's because my son is an obsessed Zelda fan. He's playing Breath of the Wild. He basically finished it maybe like one and a half months back, but he's like, he's taking all the shrines. He's, yeah, he's making that game his bitch. Anyway, I've been listening with him to the Zelda soundtrack. I don't know what it's called. I'll link it somewhere, but it's basically a medley of Zelda songs that are available on Apple Music. It's probably on Spotify as well, uh, with shitty orchestral sounds. But still, it's so awesomely arranged that it's definitely worth listening to. I've been enjoying that. Actually, now when I travel to Spain back... Oh, oh, I'm flexing. Sorry, I'm flexing. Oh, I went to Spain and Barcelona last week. I did it because I, I, I needed to work. And I listened to that album only. And there's also a Breath of the Wild piano version out there. Piano and flute, basically. So if you're into Zelda... It's awesome. If you're not into Zelda, uh, it's probably not as awesome. Anyway, that's all I wanted to say. Uh, yeah, I'm happy. Have a good Friday, everyone. I'm going to open a beer right now, off camera. Or maybe I'm just lying. It's actually Monday. I'll probably go grab a Coke Zero or something.